Ed, our new third place YCS champion of the world. <laughs> Let's get into that beautiful deck profile of yours. Uh, I play Paleos like Frogs because I've never toppled a Pendulum deck. <laughs> so, I was going to play Metal Folk, but then <laughs> he's mad I beat him. Okay, so I play 3 Swap. He's broken because he, he's like Tor God. Um, he's like a really bad Skarm. This is Tidal. And it's like Blizzard. He's like really good. <laughs> he's like Blizzard. Yeah, he's like crazy good because uh, when you summon him, you can uh, special summon, you can make a tree toad. And then uh, if you open up like him and him and another water, you can make double tree toad. And it's really cool because a uh, tree toad can add him back. So you, there are games where you run out of frogs to banish and you get like infinite uh, rank twos. Uh, I play three of the best spell in the game Repaw Desire. Uh, it's cool because uh, this deck's not really a combo deck. So. You don't really mind banishing a lot of the cards as long as it's not double Ronin. And uh, if it's ever dead, you play like the Karma Cut card. And then I play the Paleozoics. I play two of the Destiny Draw one. It's really good, but it's really clunky uh, if you like want to have defensive traps. So I only play two. I play three Book of Moon. Uh, this card sucks against Metal Foes, but it's like broken against every other matchup. I play uh, the three of this card. It's Karma Cut and can target spells and traps, so it's like really good. This card's like MVP, like I've never been more happy about a Dust Tornado in my entire life. <laughs> it's like crazy good. Uh, some people, a lot of people don't play this, I guess, all three of this, but it's really good because uh, it's like a starter card and it's, yeah, it's just a starter card. You just get more traps in the graveyard and then it combos with a Foolish Burial. So I normally lose to like Danko and Jinzo. So game two and three, I activate this, dump this, and now they have to kill me the turn they summon it or else I can just like pop off and kill them. Uh, three strike because it's really good against Pendulum and stuff like that. And one warning, same thing. Uh, three Wabaku, literally the best trap card in the deck. It's crazy good because your monsters are like unaffected by uh, monster effects. So most decks have no way to kill uh, kill them. So except by battle, it's really really strong. One compulse is cool because you can bounce your Gradle Slime Junior. It's a chainable trap, so you can just activate it like whenever. And it's really good against like Mithril and stuff like that. And it's my favorite card. Uh, three reckless greed. Uh, I just like drawing cards. <laughs> uh, extra deck. Play three totally awesome. This card is like ridiculous. Uh, if it stays on the field, like you automatically win. Uh, two of this card. Um, <laughs> Obama, Opa, Obina. <laughs> Obama. Uh, he's really good because he gets your engine going. It's kind of like spellbook. So if you have one turn, oh, it's actually like ritual beast. Like if you have like if you have like monsters on the board, then you just make him, and then you like filter out through your deck. You like search a D draw, or you like MST keep summoning traps. He lets you use, uh, use traps from your hand, and he's basically like a rotor for any trap. This guy's like insane. Uh, he basically, once you run out of traps, you make him and he becomes a trap. Like he pops a card every single turn and he just clears the way so you can actually like attack. Uh, two Cat Shark because I was having a tough time like actually ending games. So Cat Shark's really good because I usually use one to uh, like beat over monsters and the other one to actually just like kill them. Uh, downer because piercing is good and there are a lot of games where I go this and cat shark and then uh, pump this and attack over like defense mode tokens and stuff like that. I never summoned this card, I never summoned this card, never summoned this card, never summoned this card, but they're all good. They have like uh, like random effects that like would help you, but nine times out of ten you just summon tree toad and Obama. <laughs> and then, uh, one phoenix, he's crazy good because he attacks twice. Uh, side deck, I play two maxi. Uh, I drew this a lot, and going second, and that won me like infinite games. Uh, to barrier statue because blue eyes is really hard, so I just wanted to play like uh, they have no fun card. <laughs> uh, to gamma seal, I didn't like maining it because it's not really like an engine card. It's like playing regeki, but you can just get this back. It's really good against heroes and other decks like that. Uh, two system down because ABC is kind of hard, but it's not really that hard. You don't really need three system down. So I just need this, because like honestly, if you set five traps, Buster can't like efficiently kill like all your monsters. And like, your traps don't die. Uh, this, because Dark Law is really scary. And like, uh, this card's like kind of really good against like Metaphor, because like they make like huge boards and then you just like break them, and then you force them to activate the fusion. Uh, 
I didn't have two twin twisters. So I was like, <laughs> Straight one caught in the cyclone. Uh, this guy, this guy. I think I, I, I should have side two of these because like going second, like breaking two back. Like this deck automatically wins when it's a super simplified game state because you just it's like you just get an extra card every turn. So like simplifying the game and removing two extra cards every turn is like really good. Uh, best card. I never <laughs> lost to a single metal foes today because I side this against everything. It's broken. Like you side against blue eyes. <laughs> he's he's just mad. <laughs> like I won. <laughs> I won in top eight. I won in top four because uh, I just flipped this card and you have a tree toad. You automatically win. It's like broken. I side against everything. All right. What are your shout outs? I know you have to have them. I want to shout out uh, Skylar Hennessy. Shout out to Jobber. Best team. Best team ever. Hands down. Uh, shout out to Elvis Vu. Asala. Shout outs to um, Trinell. He's a beast. Shout out to Zach. Shout out to everyone. Shout out to Jana. Shout out to. I'm trying to think of like random people. Mom, Dad. Oh no! Adam Mama. Adam Mama Snake charmed me into playing metal. Folks. That was like the incorrect Snake choice. Shout out to everyone that let me borrow cards. Shout out to Rob Loa. Shout out to Rob Loa. Oh, I love damn. Rob. And yeah, I'm gonna leave it at that. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you guys for coming out. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't forget your mom no and dad, too. Oh, They're shouts, rooting you on. Shouts to Mama Reception and shouts to my dad because they, like, love me and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're signing out. Congratulations.